Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. In this video, I'm going to show you on how to use the running sum in creating a report in Microsoft Access. To give you an idea, let me show you my sample guys. This is my product list and as you can see, there is a numbering 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1. But this numbering guys is not included in the product list. So as you can see in my product list table, there's no 1, 2, 3, 4, her. there's no numbering. But in the product list, we have it. So how to do this? If you are still interested, please watch this video until the end and please subscribe if you have not yet subscribed. <music> close and then click create and then go to report wizard so we have to use this report wizard because there's a lot of field and we have to choose a few fields only so we need this category and in the product code also product name and then this list price this is it and then click next and then I have to group I have to group by category next i don't need this one next and then there are three options if we choose the black so this would be the result so i have to prepare this step okay next and then the product list let's type uh, that's it finish so this would be the uh, result so we have to align this okay na 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 and then I have to use this now I prefer to use these colors also this one uh, transparent for this one I don't like a none so let's try guys for the beverage let's put none okay so this is it and now to put the numbering guys we have to add another field. We can just copy this, guys. Copy, paste. And let us put it here. Let's go back. And then, go to property sheet. And then, for the data source, you can delete this. And then, let's type equals 1. Let's put in the center. So now let's try. So as you can see, only one, there's nothing special. So to continue, go to design view and then click this. As you observe guys, running sum. This is what I have said, running sum. There are two options aside from no. So there is overgroup and overall. If we choose this overall, let us try. One, two, three. Never mind this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, this is it. So it counts over the group. So instead of using this one, we have to choose the second one. This one, guys. Over group instead of overall. Let's try. 
okay 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 so this is what i have said and then to put another uh, settings format so click this go to format and then let's put number sign and then period in close parenthesis so let's go to preview so this is it so one two three four one two three four this is the result guys so this is enough if you have some question guys you can comment your question below i have to answer it as much as possible and then if you are new to this channel and wants to learn more about microsoft access then please consider subscribing this channel that's all thank you and see you to my next video